All right, here we go. Welcome. First, uh, first of the what are we gonna Vod call this? Podcast. Podcast. Yeah. What are we gonna call this? The uh, well, we've been talking about this for about six months, and uh, we decided we're gonna call it the uh, the Gears and Beers Show. Heck yeah. Because yeah. we're gonna talk about cars. Obviously, you know, we're, we're Chevrolet fans, but we're we're car fans in general. And then um, we're gonna enjoy a beer throughout the show. So I think that's what we gotta start with right now. Oh, Chris, yeah. would you bring over and throw my refrigerator there? You bet. None other than the number one rated IPA in the world, as rated by RateBeer.com. This is Two Hearted Ale by Bell's Brewery here in Michigan. Phenomenal IPA. If you like IPAs, it's also the same brewer who, who makes Hop Slam. Hop Slam. Love Hop Slam. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, why is there a fish on the bottle? Well, Two Hearted is the name of the river, a uh, river up oh, north. There we go. Uh, that's how they got their name for the spear. Cool. You know, this expired uh, last November. Yeah. Oh, no, that's when it's packaged. All right, let's crack it open. All right? Yeah. And all, uh, as always, don't drink, don't drive. We don't. Go ahead and drink, but just don't drive. Be stupid about it. Cheers to our first show pilot, or whatever you want to call it. Yeah. Here we go. Too hard so, in here. So the beers and gears to cheers to cheers, cheers to the, the beers, beers and, and gears. gears. Yeah. yeah. All right. I'm starting to really appreciate an IPA. Mm. Love that taste. Real crisp, clean. Finish on that. All right. So we got the beer part. Let's talk about the gears. We've been doing. A podcast together for what? How many years? Seven. Seven years. Seven years. Forever. We've been doing the Camaro Z28.com podcast, mm -hmm. and uh, a lot of times people would say, uh, uh, "Do a video version." And we're like, "Yeah, no, no." So we we kicked it around and kicked it around, and then we thought, "Well, let's let's just put something together." So this is it. We had enough people saying, "You know what? You guys need to do a video podcast." So we didn't want to do just another video podcast. We had to come up with something. It's gonna be a little bit more, a little bit more unique. I, I thought something that we know. We know cars. We know cars. No, yeah. and we're starting to know beer. Yeah, we we love beer. We we enjoy beer. Yeah, we're not like love beer lush as anything. No, I, we like to appreciate a fine beer. Bell's is good. I, I like Bell's. Yeah. Um, I had um, yesterday I had their all all day IPA. Well, that's Founders. Or yeah, for, for Founders. Another Michigan. Michigan. Another Michigan. Oh, absolutely. Brewery, so. Yeah. Well, let's get talking about the car thing. Um. Let's talk about the thing that, that's really in the buzz this time of year, and that's the 6th Gen Camaro. Yep. Going to be brought back here to Michigan, the Grand River uh, Assembly Plant in Lansing. In Lansing, my old stomping ground. Your old stomping ground, so uh, we should be able to see some of these things uh, in the streets soon, don't you think? Gosh, I would think so, but then again... I mean, if, it's getting close to us. Well, it is spring. Well, if it's not going to be like a radical departure from the current fifth gen, they may be sneaky like they did with the uh, the the C5. That's true. And just keep the fifth gen skin over the sixth gen underpinnings. Or you know, we could see some crazy looking ATSs. Do you remember back in the day when? Yeah, well, yeah, that's probably what it's going to be. It's going to be like an ATS that just doesn't look right at all. Right. But remember back in the day when they were testing um, um, a Camaro and they had a Trans Am front and a Camaro rear. And we call the it trans the, the, the Transmero. Trans or the, yeah, that was pretty. Weird. I remember you put that up on the website, and people were like, "That's Photoshop. Oh, no that's fake." And you even had the picture of the inside that said something like "airbag disabled" or yeah. something like yeah. that. That was yeah. if it was photoshopped. I did a damn good job. Yeah, you did. It's still up on the website too. God. Yeah, and so if this, if you're watching this and you don't know who the hell we are, before we did the Camaro Z28.com podcast. We did uh, CamaroZ28.com, we're the original co-founders of it, uh, and that was went back to what, 96, 95? 96, yeah. Yeah, it's been a long time, long time. So, um, you know, we need to get, if we're going to continue doing this, we need to get some special guests in here. We can have them sit right up here, right here, <laughs> and, and turn it off. And just, and just pop their head up and, <laughs> and just say, hey, uh, you know, while you were thinking of that. Um, you know, oh, how do you guys like the Debler bar? I, I love it, man. See, normally there's a, there's a, there's there's actually a mirror back. Well, yeah, I had to cover up some some things, but uh, see, I have a nice day. There's actually a, a mirror back here, but it would look really screwy to see the camera in the mirror. So I pulled out one of my uh, Chevrolet Bowtie flags just to throw up there, so it wouldn't be goofy how, how looking. How old is that thing? Um, I probably had it for ten years or so. 
It, it was, uh, I used to fly it at the uh, Michigan GM events. That's right. So it's been maybe longer than that. Yeah. But, uh, cool. So, um, you know, I, I really need to, here. <laughs> All right. So Obviously, what else, what else a, can we talk about? Pilot. This is this is a pilot. <laughs> um, anybody who watched Pulp Fiction knows what a pilot is, because there's a description in that movie of what a pilot is. This is a pilot. This is a really crappy pilot. There's a shows, and on those shows, <laughs> what is it? What was it? Uh, Travolta said. Well, you do realize there's a TV, and on this thing, the show shows or something like that. Something like that. <laughs> the pilot yeah so if we do more of these um, it's going to kind of follow the same format where we crack open some fine beer craft beer craft beer not crap it might be crap well, I mean, I mean, it no. depends on what they think of it that's true and then we're gonna talk about cars how many um how many cars you had oh geez um this is boring yeah <laughs> Let's see two Grand Nationals four Camaros Five Camaros. Five Camaros? Well, you got your 93, your 95, your 2001, oh, right. your 2002. Right. And then? My, my and then 2010. 2010. My 2012. Your 2012. Wow. Yeah. Wow. I've had three. Have I had three? I've had three. I only have one. You only have one now. I don't have one right now. I'm in between Camaros. I'm waiting for that sixth gen to come out. Yeah. And we talked about it on the CamaroZ28.com podcast that was just recently... This released is episode number 446. Uh, talk about this dream that I had where I went out and bought a ZL1. I don't think my wife would appreciate that very much. But, um. Wake the neighbors. I, I used to. <laughs> the guy that lives next door. Oh, man. When I crack open my 2010. <laughs> he's like, it scares the crap out of me. Oh, I love that beer. Yeah, it's good stuff. Love it. So if you get a chance to get some Bells Too Hearted, and we pay for this. They don't send us this stuff for free. No. Yet, Bells, if you're out there and you Bells. want to send us some stuff, by all means, we'll accept it. Right here. Right here. Uh, Bells distributes, I think, um, to the left coast. So um, Ohio, Pennsylvania, into New York, uh, down south. I know in Florida. Uh I think Indiana, that way. So mostly the left, like the left, like, the right, like east the right, of Mississippi sorry, right, is really what yeah, it is. Basically, yeah. Uh, Bell'sBrewery.com, I believe, is their, their website. Here. Bell's Beer. Bell's yeah. Beer. Okay. Dot com. What else we want to talk about? See, this is like our first podcast. Our first podcast was just like what this. How we're going to talk about? And how long are we going to make the show? I don't know. Probably uh, hour and a half, two hours. <laughs> How many beers are we gonna go through now? <laughs> till we're done with the beer. An hour and a half later, like <laughs> talk till we're done with the beer. Like oh god, I can't drink any more beer. Or we, or we run out of what we want to say. Well, we've already done that, you know, five minutes yeah. ago. Yeah. Ring well, the bell. Ring the bell. Those who used to visit Devler's Bar knows this sound. <laughs> Shot time. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't had a party down here in years. Oh. We used to have it's one, maybe long, two, three, in a summer. Long overdue. Two, three. Yeah. Long overdue. Well, yeah, I don't know. The rest of it. See, what's on, be on behind the camera is typical basement. It's got a bunch of crap in it. Yeah. I wanted to bring up that picture again. Which one? The one we talked about on the podcast today. Oh, the one with wanna, Mary Barra? Yeah. I want to bring that back up and I want to discuss this more. All right. I'm trying to think if I got anything cool. While you're looking that up. Vintage Camaro Z28.com lunchbox. <laughs> yeah. I don't think there's anything in it. If there is, somebody put something in there. Jimmy Hoffa. Yeah. No kidding. Okay, so here we go. Here's the picture. Okay. So this is what we were talking about in the podcast. I don't know if you guys know, can It's see probably this. not going to show up too no. well, but uh, it's probably not going to show up at all. Probably not. Need to show me anyways. But anyways, take a look at this here. Okay. No, that's no So accident. we got that there. And then this, which looks absolutely nothing like a Camaro. This here. Well, what, what about that on the left? That looks that thing? sort of kind of like... 
you know, if you were to take like 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 a current Malibu front end and yeah. stick it on a Camaro, yeah, that's what you'd get. So here's a great question: is 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 the next Camaro going to have more of the traditional? I don't know what they call. It. I think they call it the bar, like you know where it's got the it's got the bar across the grill with a bow tie above it or somewhere near it, and then mm -hmm. another opening, and then the headlights. Is it going to be like that, where it know. adopts? I mean, like the Chevy Traverse has, has had all the Chevrolet vehicles, even the trucks have it that yeah, way. They do. Is Camaro the only? Th well, Corvette's kind of the exception, but is, yeah. is Camaro the only real passenger car that doesn't that doesn't have that design to the it? Bolt. Again, that's a special one. I mean, yeah. it, I think it it kind of does, but it's it's just not as is is uh, prominent. Yeah, yeah. I mean, what do you guys think? I mean, do you think that the next Camaro, if they say it's going to be something that's um, evolutionary, not revolutionary, from the current generation Camaro, the front end is obviously the most polarizing part of the car because it's what you see, at least briefly, more so the tail Unless you talk to some people, then the back end is the most polarizing thing. <laughs> well, okay, front, front or rear. Um, you know, what, what do you think? Is it going to be? Uh, is it going to be more traditional Chevrolet, or is it going to be? more traditional to fifth gen uniqueness. I think it's going to be more fifth gen uniqueness. Which does have a similar type design. It's just it's just not so quite as familiar. Obviously they're going to lose some weight because it's going to be on the ATS platform. Speaking of which. How many calories? Yeah. <laughs> Usually IPAs are around 200 calories per bottle. Well, good thing I got an elliptical right over there. <laughs> And the next half hour will be us on the elliptical. Okay. Um, what was I saying? I don't know. The, the, uh, losing the, some weight. Getting losing some, some weight. Uh, it's lighter and smaller. The, it's going to be on the ATS platform. Mm -hmm. So it's going to be smaller. So, And that will make a lot of people happy. I think so. The naysayers of... Uh, uh, the, the, the pig... The, 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 the pig... Uh, Comments. That Camaro's a fat pig. They're never gonna make it go fast. Z28. Z01. There's no way that you can out engineer weight. <clears throat> yeah. They'll find an excuse for anything. Stilo is the word that yeah. we're looking for here. Yeah. Just insert Stilo. <laughs> insert Stilo. <laughs> oh gosh. Um I'm excited. I'm very um, excited. We got about a year and a half to wait. We assume. Yeah, we're figuring. So, if uh, this is going to be released as a 2016 model, mm -hmm. then 2015 North American International Auto Show in Detroit, it'll probably debut. About ten months from now. And then, like you said earlier today, probably out fall 2015. That's what we're. That's what the assumption is. Yeah. And then I'll get one. Because by then I will we'll have uh, sold one of my kidneys. Or my liver. Hmm. Now the the fifth gen was released. When did that come out? Uh, I, think I, I took delivery of my car in May of 2009. End of May 2009. That was and a hell I of a... put it in, and we both, we ordered our cars together. Yep. That was in, what was oh. that? That was a... October, November of 2008, because we were the day <laughs> we could right. order, we were there. Yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Considering that the Camaro concept was shown in 2000, in like January of 2006, right. that was probably the longest two years of my life. It was very long. And we're less than that away from the next gen Camaro, I if know. we look at it that way. I imagine. Well, well, I don't know. So, I guess. Create a channel on YouTube yeah, we'll for this. Channel. Uh, you'll be able to leave your comments there. You can always shoot us an email. At, well, I think we should probably hit, stick to the public comments for yeah. this yeah. so we don't get the messages mixed up. Yeah. So uh, leave your comments below. Tell us what you think of the show. Please share it with your friends. Um, and, but let us know. I mean, Is this any good? I should mean, we keep doing this? Yeah. Just like our first podcast, uh, it'll get it was better. Rough. Yeah. Our first, Go back and listen to CamaroZ28.com podcast number one. It was... It was just I'm trying to think of that ad. Just it's crap. It's uh, CZ two eight com dot blogspot dot com.
Yep. Yep. And you can go all the way back to the first one. First one was 2005 really is when it came out. That was before the fifth gen was really even thought of. So let's bring it up. Here we go. And the date was <laughs> September 6, 2005. I wonder how long that episode was. It was probably about nine minutes. Yeah. I remember it being somewhat. So the point is, is that that this is this is just a rough start, yeah. and and your feedback and your comments uh, help us determine whether ten or not. minutes and forty three seconds. Oh, wow. <laughs> cool. Yeah, uh, helps us determine whether or not it's going to go further. So, uh, if you like the CamaroZ20 dot com podcast and you're a loyal listener, hopefully you'll like what we're doing here. Maybe we'll start doing it once a month. If you like beer, once every couple weeks, and you want to send us some. Message us and we'll give you instructions on how to send it to us too. <laughs> or if you like a good, good beer and you just have a suggestion of something that we should try that is available in the Detroit, Michigan area, yeah, and you can't beers, send it to us. And yeah, all beers are unfortunately available all over the country. We need to change that. Mm -hmm. So I guess we should probably uh, wrap wrap this up and okay. go relax for a while and see you next time. Should there be one? Cheers. Cheers. What takes? <laughs> Do you want to get an iPad or anything? No. no. I want you uh pull shit up. Yeah. All right. Are we ready? Mm-hmm.